Hello, welcome back to Blue Harvest Toys. A little special little uh, package I got today. Um, I won these on eBay, and they only showed that one uh, in the uh, in the picture. It did say games, but it only showed that one. So I did win these for eight pound, or four of them for eight pound. So I did have this one as a kid. These are called the Pocketeers, obviously from Palatoy. Um, I'm going to be doing a Palatoy shelf, a little shrine to Palatoy. So I'm trying to find anything that's, that's Palatoy related. Paperwork, boxes, anything that says Palatoy on it basically. So this is how this one works. Very basic. As you'll see, they all are. They really are all are basic. Oh, look, I've got four points there. So yeah, it's it's not it's not the best. It's got it's coming away, but that's going to go on display. That doesn't have the box, but that's the one I did have. Now the next one is Vegas, and um, I have read on um, how to do this. It will show, tell you how to do this. Um, I haven't bought these to play with. I've bought them because it's a palatine. They, they, they look good on display. So what you basically do is you you wind it up. It's got a little dot there. You wind it up. And then you press the start button and it vibrates and you've got to get all these in order. Basic, basic game. But uh, was it brilliant back in the day. So next we've got poker. Uh, again, the, bo the box is, isn't the best on that one. But uh, for what I paid, it does seem to have a bit of melting damage there. <laughs> I thought it might have been either glue or sellotape before but it's, it looks like it's been melted but never mind this is basically poker so you just it does lock it into place so we've got a joker ace got two aces not bad not bad hand there really good to a couple of aces yeah so it's a not a bad game not a bad game if you want to play poker as when you were a kid <laughs> and then lastly we've got pitfall which is uh, quite a uh, favorite of a lot of people you pull it down and you've got to guide the little metal bit Starts it. You've got to guide it, and that didn't do well, very well. I got I got thirty points there, but basically you've got to try and guide it and get it up to the top. It's not easy, as you can see, but there we go. Just little little um, little games. Again, I'm not going to play them. I'm going to put them display. They are pro proper nostalgia. That that is especially that one. That one I did have. There are there are a few that I did have that I'm going to be. Um, hunting they're not cheap by any stretch of imagination you can be paying £25 each for these especially in the boxes so to get these for £8 is, is a is a bargain and um, I will be looking out for the others, I don't know how many they are I think there might be about 30 different ones so I'm going to be looking for all those so there we go we're going to get those on the Palatoy shelf now, so join me over there so here we go, here's a Palatoy. It is a Palatoy shelf for now. Um, there they are, they're the Pocketeers. With all the Palatoy stuff in there. Oh, that's not Palatoy, but it can stay in there. Stay with my uh, speeder bike collection. So yeah, nice few bits. I'm gonna collect more, and obviously if it gets any bigger, it'll move, because I've been rearranging things. The lady shelf has now gone onto the second shelf. Um, things have been moved around a bit. Been changing things about. I'm making more room to be honest with you. And yes, the lady shelf is now the Batman shelf. Not just, not all my Batman stuff. There's, there's so much Batman stuff that I've got, but yeah, that. For now, it's gonna be the Bat shelf. I, I do have another Bat. Lego Batman built to build so I can go there. Um, that has been rearranged. Again, it's it's temporary, it's temporary till uh, I might conglomerate all that into there again. 
and have that as a palatite shelf next. Uh, the thing is, I've got me Jabba's Palace there. I always like to get the Rancor under there. I might do that, to be honest with you. I've got the Rancor up there. I might put that under there. It's, it's, everything's in flux. Everything's in flux. Uh, I have moved the Star Wars bits are down there now. The Marvel bits are there. Um, put the light on so you can see that better. And uh, Back to the Future st is staying there. And the Knight Rider has gone in there with the new sign. All my Knight Rider stuff has gone in there. I do have a new piece that's going to go in there too. Uh, obviously <laughs> the kit is not going to fit in there. It's, there's Tom just hanging about there as well. But uh, yeah, I think I'm quite happy with that. And those uh, new additions. Uh, I'm going to be looking out for more Palatoy stuff. So if you can help me out, that'd be wonderful. I just want to make this Palatoy shelf grow. Give Palatoy some love. So thank you for watching. Until the next time, may the toys be with you. Can you stop banging for five minutes, please?